Hello, hello, this is Mine Kralix here, and welcome to episode 8 of Vanilla Super Flat Survival. And something extremely horrible has just happened. That's why I'm on my game menu. Oh. And that is the exact reason that I'm filming right now. I was planning to film something else. But. During daytime. My mob grinder. It just uh, fell into pieces, a creeper exploded and uh, destroyed the chute, and now there's a bunch of mobs roaming around my island, well not my island, but my enclosed area. Uh, and the worst part is that I added pressure plates, but mobs can activate the pressure plates, so I'm not even safe inside my house. This is very, very horrible. Uh, very, very bad. Um, thankfully I have some resources in... Um, in my house, such as wood and cobblestone, which I made some stone swords with. Uh, bow, unfortunately, I don't have any arrows with me, so I have to take arrows from that chest right there. And as you can see, there's right now just a bunch of mobs standing. I guess the only shelter I can take is up there, and they just keep on falling and falling. Um, so I basically made this into an XP grinder by making it a bit higher uh, and trying to have it... Um, be an XP grinder so I can get iron from zombies, but uh, for some reason a creeper blew up and uh, it just caused them to all come out and look, they're still going, so that's something that's not very good and I lost a lot of very good stuff so what I'm planning to do is I'm going to go get my arrows and stuff real quick um uh no no no, okay Okay, at least I'm not dead. Okay, looks like we're safe for now. We have some rotten flesh to keep our uh, health up. So, uh, on the bright side, we did get some arrows. So, I guess we can kill off some of those skellies over there. I have no idea why there's so much... Yeah, that's not working out very well, is it? I hope I can get past them without uh, dying again. This is always my worst nightmare. A worst nightmare is having my mob grinder be blown up by these uh, skellies and... Uh, no, I mean being blown up by creepers and... Uh, Losing a bunch of my stuff. And they just keep on going and going, and they won't keep on going until it's nighttime. And yeah. At least most of them are uh, one hit kill. Oh, yeah, this is actually going to be fairly easy since most of them are one hit kill. But they keep on falling faster than I can actually kill them. Let's make sure to kill some of the creepers out. Okay, now we have to actually seal off most of the area right here. Okay, I hope I don't get hit more. Um, let's see, I still have uh, rotten flesh for food. Uh, this isn't that bad since we can one hit kill them, so um, let's see. Uh, I think I have to... One issue that I had is I didn't have uh, cobblestone in my hotbar because when I get to the grinder, I have to close it up as fast as possible. And... My thoughts on making an XP grinder is that I'm going to make um, a separate grinder if I need an XP grinder, and I won't experiment with this one anymore because uh, just too much. Too much. Okay, now there's a spider going up there for no reason. Uh, great, think he died. Um, the skeletons are the worst. I mean, I can't avoid the zombies, but the skeletons, when they just start shooting at me, that's when it's the worst. Uh, so that's what I'm targeting right now, mostly. And also the spiders are a nuisance too. No, 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 no. <sighs> yes, I just had to mute it a bit. Um. Ah. I don't know if I can ever get this under control because the more I try to get to there um, the more the creepers start falling and uh, destroying my s well, not only my stuff but also uh, just start widening the hole 
Okay, for some reason, there's just... I Where did my stuff go? I just died. Um, okay, well, I can hear some skeletons. I can hear some of them burning, which is already a good thing, so... Okay, so I guess I'm going to have to go back in my house and craft some more uh, equipment. No. <sighs> this is not happening. And one thing I will not do is I won't cheat anything in because, uh... Okay, but they're one hit kill, right? So I can at least get some of my stuff back, can I? Well, except for the... Except for the spiders, they're not one hit kill. Okay, if I get... Uh... Yeah, I don't know if this is really working out as well as I supposed it would. I think that I have to try a new strategy. Oh, this is not working out good. This is not good. Okay, I won't set it to less than hard because I'm a hardcore gamer. And Okay, at least some of the spiders have been uh, non-hostile to me. Okay, let's see, what have I gotten? Well, I've got my wood back. Um, I still have to find my cobblestone, though. Um, oh, yeah, there it is. There's my cobblestone. Uh, there's my bow. Let me sure, just, just run over here. They don't get me. Um, yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me just regroup. Okay, I haven't gotten most of my arrows back, so... That's something to be worried about. Uh, I still have rotten flesh for food, that's for sure. I can still hear the mobs going in. My worst nightmare would be actually mobs destroying my chest because that's where all of my, uh, because obviously the. Okay, I'm going to shield myself from the attacks using, uh, the lock. Okay, I'm kind of running out of arrows now. Um, my only hope is that. During the night time, one good thing about this grinder, well, at first I thought it was a negative side of the grinder, but now I see how it could be a positive. Um, the thing is that, um, when it's, when it's, um, oh, good thing that, oh, I, I just checked to see if, um, if the, the creeper that blew up actually destroyed my chest with all of the loot inside, right there, I set up a chest with a bunch of loot inside, um, so, uh, anyway, like I said, I thought this was going to be a negative aspect of the grinder, however, um, this is a positive one, uh, that, well, now I see that it is a positive one, because now that it's nighttime, the mobs will actually stop, um, there won't be mobs falling down, and there is only, like, mobs falling down every two minutes or so, uh, so that leaves me enough of a window to kill off all the existing mobs, and, and basically, like, um, replenish all the, okay, one issue is that, um, I am low on arrows, so... Let's see, is there any mobs up close somewhere here? Okay, let me just regen real quick. Gotta get those creepers over there, since they can't shoot me. Okay, I got only four... Yeah, I forgot spiders could climb. Uh, let me just get that creeper there real quick. Um, I think we're doing fairly well. I mean, as long as the... As long as there's no more damage being done, and... Uh, Seems like the flow of mobs has stopped, however, I am low on arrows. All of the spawns are going to that side over there. Oh, so here's one thing. I made a bunch of outhouses. I made a system of underground tunnels right here. I've been playing for about um, two or three hours off camera, so I've achieved quite a bit. I've achieved quite a bit in the time span um, because I've been playing for about three or so hours. Uh, as you can see, there's a tunnel over there that goes in. Uh, I built an outhouse over there. That's um, that's um, access point east, access point north, access point. Oh no, this is access point west, access point north, uh, access point east, access point south. And as you can see under F, it says three, and then it says east. So, uh, right there's the tunnel that goes out to that outhouse there, right there's the tunnel that goes out to that outhouse there, and inside my house there's a tunnel that goes out to that outhouse over there, and, um, right there's the tunnel that goes there. And the reason I made this is because, um, I wouldn't be able, 
I did not want to make any doors or openings inside this gate right here because this is a completely sealed area and the only accessible area is either through the air or um, either underground which I have built the tunnels underneath uh, and that is so during the daytime when there's a lot of slime so how did that just happen? Oh, I think the zombies can climb the um, ladders. Yeah, I shouldn't have gotten distracted. I was just regenning. So um, let me just show you. Here's one of my how one of my outhouses looks like. Um, here's a crafting table underneath. Uh, it's surrounded by cobblestone just to make sure mobs or slimes don't get in here during the uh, daytime and nighttime. Right here is two base, two village. Um, and um, I decided to connect it with the tunnel that goes to, that connects the village uh, base to uh, this area here. Um, let's go regain our stuff from that zombie with the sword before it gets all despawned. Um, let me just knock him off. Oh, yeah, I actually got my sword back. That's great. I think he picked up one of my swords. That's why he has a sword, so. Um, nope. 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 Uh, yeah, my, uh, um, my bow has gone somewhere, so that's something to worry about. Okay, here's... And he had to kill me at that point. Let me just go into my statistics and see how many times I actually died. Ah, damage, number of deaths, 16. I've died 16 times. Oh my god. We have to get this mob nightmare out um, in control before daytime because uh, that's when all hope will be lost. At least the mobs aren't falling as fast as they used to. Um, okay, how much mobs? Okay, there's some skellies inside my house right now. Let's see if maybe I could get some some of my equipment back. Okay, now this seems more or over under control. Okay, let me just get all this stuff right here. Um, let me just remember. I think that I have what. What other stuff did I do while I was off camera? Uh, well, I did kill some Endermen, that's for sure. I remember I killed some Endermen. Uh, I've collected a lot of cobblestone for those outhouses. I've built these poles. I've crafted signs to... I've made these tunnels. I made some changes underneath there. Um, okay, this is the time that we're going to take our island back. And, of course... I don't seem to have enough. I don't have to. I don't actually have. I really need a pickaxe right now. I just really need a pickaxe just about now. Okay, I hope I don't die anymore. Um, okay, I just don't care how I'm going to put this together. Just at least. Okay, is the flow stopped? Okay, so let's say that this is more over under control now. Um, now I have to deal with uh, all of the mobs inside my house. It's going to be a difficult task considering that um, it's very sensitive to creeper explosions because if a creeper does explode inside my house, that's uh, game over because uh, all my crap is going to get exploded. Um, let me just, I'm going to regen until, uh, until, uh, Yep, dead. Um, yes, like I said before, I installed all these pressure plates, and I was like, oh yeah, mobs will never walk on the pressure plates. And the most ironic thing is, is that the same time that I actually installed the plates, that's when, uh, that's when they became such a nuisance. Um, so, I don't know, I think, I think I have enough health to go in. Wait, that's it? No more. No more. Okay, let me just check in the tunnel. Oh, I knew that there was something hiding in the tunnel. I, I just knew it. It had to be. Okay, this is going to be, to be a one-hit kill. Uh, yeah, looks like our issue was kind of... Looks like our issue was kept put under control. I've lost quite a bit of uh, 
things have lost quite a bit of XP. Uh, I wouldn't say I lost any things that are too important. I guess I did lose some carrots. I did lose some, uh... I did lose some... Arrows, which is okay. Well, I wasn't ha I didn't have any armor on, so I guess that's a good part. Um... Okay, now, what am I supposed to do? Oh, yes, so I'm going to just, uh, craft a pickaxe right now real quick. I also lost some picks. I'm going to craft a pickaxe real quick right now so I can, um... Uh, demolish everything around the grinder right here so I can get it back under control. I also lost a fence gate that used to be here, huh? Well, nothing too serious. At least, uh, at least we got it under control in, uh, in a reasonable amount of time, so... I guess, uh... I guess it could have been worse. Okay, so this is basically where the chamber is. Okay. Okay, we have to make sure that we demolish this whole thing before it, um... Before another creeper falls down and, uh, we get... Messed over again, um... Okay... And looks like our uh, mob grinder is now officially back to action once more. Um, let me reinstall my uh, fence gate that used to be here. Oh yes, I think I installed this fence gate just recently. Let me just craft one real quick. Um, I you know I have all the mem um, all the recipes memorized by now. I don't know about people who use like mods that um, like that show the recipes and mods that can allow you to save your inventory. I think that's kind of cheating, like, ah, uh, I forgot. Oh, I think it's called too many items and not enough items. Wow, and right before sunrise, we were able to neutralize the issue. Um, I think I've had enough uh, stress over this episode, uh, and uh, I hope this was an interesting episode for you to watch as well. It was quite an experience for me as well. It doesn't happen as much to me. Uh, at least we're not playing in Skyblock because it would have been even worse. Um, it was kind of a nuisance that every time we died, we spawned back at that village over there, but it's great that I have the um, tunnel over there, so that connects it, so... Um, I was really planning in this episode to go search more villages. However, um, when this thing came up, I just decided to start. I just decided to start filming just because. Well, um, I think it's something interesting for you to watch. Uh, killing mobs is uh, it's it's quite of an experience for me myself. So um, this is Minecraft. This was episode seven, or or was this episode eight? Well, I kind of forgot already. Uh, anyway, this is Minecraft. Uh, thank you very, very much for watching, uh, and I'm out.